Also new at 10, the UW Madison police are asking for your help tonight. That's right. Last Friday, they realized a painting was stolen from campus in broad daylight. And the night team's Emily Cumlin shows us how social media is helping track a thief. That's right, guys. It's not every day you hear about an art theft in Madison, but police say an expensive piece of artwork was stolen from Union South on Wednesday, valued at $700. After days of going through surveillance video, police say they're closing in on the thief. Got up. Uh, literally took the piece of artwork off the wall, stuffed it in a purse, and walked away. This is the image of a woman who was accused of stealing a 9 by 12 inch painting last week Wednesday around noon from the Union South Gallery. We don't like dealing with it because uh, it's... It's an invasion of, of one's privacy to a certain extent, and, and now they're, they're in our union, and they're, they're taking valuables and, and pieces of art that people enjoy. Police won't name the artist or show us the painting, but say an out-of-state artist had it on sale. For many people, it seems like common sense that, well, why wouldn't you release what the painting looks like? Maybe I see the painting, but it's complicated stuff. It's part of our police investigation. Right now, the gallery in Union South is between shows. A new one starts next Friday. Both campus unions have galleries with 30 to 40 shows a year. We're the first union in the country to have an art gallery as part of the union. So history goes way back. I think that most people around here respect the fact that the both union buildings are uh, welcoming and that the artwork is there for everyone's enjoyment. I probably wouldn't think anything of it if people are just walking around, if they're like older adults, it's like a common place for everybody to go. Union officials hope good technology will lead to a happy ending. All the galleries are under surveillance and uh, just for rare occurrences like this, and uh, hopefully we'll recover the artwork. UW police released the suspect's picture this morning, which has already generated several tips through social media. So hopefully this will help and there is going to be a resolution to this, guys. Then. Yeah, makes sense because that picture was fairly clear. Yeah, yeah. and the, with the high-tech surveillance cameras and stuff they have, they hope that this will help along the process. Absolutely. Thanks, Emily. Thanks, Emily. Yep.